My name is Jay Grams. My family has owned the Volo Auto Museum since 1960. We have a few hundred of the most exciting collector cars and they're all for sale in one location. I personally have handpicked them from around the country. Welcome to my sales shop. Come on, let's go for a spin. Drop dead gorgeous. This has got to be a contender for the best looking 67 GTO on the planet. It's a custom house of colors color. It's just beautiful with them big 18 inch polished uh, billet wheels, uh, custom stitched interior. And believe it or not, this is a number match car. The motor, trans and rear are all correct for the car. This thing's been body off frame restored. Underneath is all redone. I was told $140,000 was spent. I was told $35,000 spent on the body and paint. I go to volocars.com. That's where you can read the specs. That's where you can study all the pictures. And you'll find price tags on every collector car we have for sale at volocars.com. If you enjoy the video, subscribe to our YouTube channel and click on that bell icon so you're notified as the new ones are posted. But for right now, that top is down. Let's go for a spin. Yeah, underneath the car looks practically brand new. It's rebuilt and detailed, but they pulled the body off the frame. Uh, the chassis was all taken apart. The frame was stripped and powder coated. Uh, all the suspension and steering components all replaced, you know, bushings, ball joints, all of that. It's all smooth, clean uh, metal on the chassis components. Uh, it has a nice dual exhaust system with pipes, stainless steel mufflers. Uh, it's got some nice tips in the back. Upgraded four-wheel disc brake system, drilled and slotted rotors all the way around. All new stainless steel brake hoses and lines. Even the e-brake assembly is all new and it has like a braided stainless uh, coverings over the cables. So the brake system's really upgraded. Uh, you look up at the motor and it's just really, really clean. Uh, it's the Turbo 400 automatic transmission. The tag on the side riveted to it still says 1967. It has a 10 bolt rear in the back. Uh, this also, I should mention, it's the F41 suspension. So it has sway bars front and rear, also boxed uh, control arms in the back. Uh, the floors are just spotless metal. Um, the car is obviously lowered, so it must have lowering springs. Uh, it has gas shocks, uh, an upgrade, uh, but it's got real nice stance. Uh, and the body, it's just amazing. Uh, the body itself, you got a hood tack. The lines and gaps are square. This all fits real nice. No issues here. This is all real good. It's a little nick in the paint. Uh, but right now I'm judging the body, not so much the paint. It is absolutely straight. The gaps are good, excellent I should say. No bubbles, no damage, no rust. Trunk fits beautifully. All this is really, really nice. Clean, straight metal. It is a house of colors, candy apple red metallic. Uh, and yeah, seeing it in person, there, you, I look that way, I don't see the metal flake. The light hits it here and it's just sparkling metal flake. It's a really deep, beautiful color. There are a few minor imperfections. There's a, a nick over on that other corner, like on the inside edge that's been touched up. Uh, a couple nicks on the edge of the door that are touched up. The rocker moldings, are the big wide moldings are polished real nice. The rest of the paint's looking really gorgeous. So the windshield looks new, door handles, mirror, uh, both mirrors look new. Headlight bezels have been replaced. It has the tri bar headlights in front there. Grills, bumper, all the stainless, all looks gorgeous. Actually, the bumpers are triple chrome plated. Then of course the wheels, they're 18 inch. They're the modern version of the Rally 2 wheel. They're billet. Uh, these look like they've been chromed even on top of that. Uh, it's got the little PMD, uh, Pontiac Motor Division center cap. The convertible top, it's a nice rich black canvas top, uh, hearts cloth top. And all the weather strips and the doors 
are replaced and the jams are beautiful. Shuts real nice. So why don't we open this baby up and see what it's like inside. All right, here's the trunk compartment. I can tell you whoever restored the car was not cheap because they sprung for a fifth tire and wheel here that matches the others. I know that wasn't cheap. Uh, these are G-Force BF Goodrich tires uh, on the car. And then the whole trunk compartment, super clean metal. It has real nice spatter paint, a uh, nice carpeted mat, uh, beautiful paint in the jams and under the trunk lid. And then you got the CD uh, changer that goes with the retro stereo. So you got a really nice, beautiful trunk compartment. That paint, gorgeous. As I was pulling it in the photo room, someone stopped me and said, that is gorgeous. And it's a cloudy, gloomy day right now. GMs are painted real nice, weather strips replaced. Door panel, armrest, all that stuff uh, looks new. The metal trims painted real nice. So it has a real nice, clean, original looking dash area, no custom gauges. Uh, dash pad is mint. It has a retro stereo, fits right in the factory location. Air conditioning vents are mounted neatly below the dash and there's speakers built into the kick panels. Not much of a glove box because they added the air conditioning. Takes up room under the dash. You see the hood tachometer out in front of you in the hood. Uh, nice walnut steering wheel. Seats have been all re-cushioned and, and bolstered, so they got nice form. And you see the stitching matches the color of the car. So real nice custom seats. Where's the button? backs of the seats, the rear seat, the side panels, everything's real nice. All the interior lights work. We've got speakers in the back. Center console's real nice. We should come back and talk about that. This is the his and hers shifter. So you want to do your daily business, you got park, reverse, neutral. You want to shift through the gears, you put it over here and basically it stops you from hitting the wrong gear. So that's when you're like speed shifting. So it's a uh, a uh, his and a hers. It's got embroidered floor mats too. And the convertible top is power. Motor compartment, uh, real sharp looking. Uh, the whole engine bay is smooth metal, painted a semi-gloss black. The engine itself is painted the Pontiac Aqua. It's real clean. Valve covers, nuts and bolts, uh, everything is real nice. Brackets. It's a Ram Air, functional Ram Air. The scoop is open, and it is a uh, sniper fuel injection system that's on there now. Got polished aluminum alternator, polished aluminum AC. Uh, system that's all you know upgraded the heat and air is a whole new system a be cool aluminum radiator with the shroud new fan it has power steering it has power brakes with a polished uh, reservoir it does have a set of headers down there Nice uh, reproduction battery cables. So real nice detailed uh, motor compartment. My showroom were a beauty pageant, I think this would win Miss Volo because this car is just gorgeous. What a pleasure this would be to drive on a nice sunny day. Uh, you'll feel like a million bucks behind the wheel of this thing. 
Someone did a really great job doing a nut and bolt restoration, and guess what? It's uh, ready for you to enjoy, done, ready to deliver right now. That's my impression. Go to volocars.com, talk to the salesmen. They'll help you finance this car. They'll help you get it delivered to your driveway. That's at volocars.com. If you enjoy the videos, don't forget to subscribe and click that bell icon so you can be the first to see the next one posted. Thanks for watching.